shall we let everyone experience a little bit about uh, Lama Fera life? Yeah, absolutely. Let's do that. Yes. And all the um, negative feelings that everyone's been, you know, expressing, all the difficult times that everyone's been talking See, about. Everyone here needs to do only one thing. See, I know I do not have, they do not have that um, the sticks to keep down, but that's perfectly fine. We are doing a distinct healing. I'm going to um, use two modalities to clear, cleanse them. They don't need to know what. But since I can do, I know a modality in which I can do group healings. I'll be using that plus Lama Fera technique to help them. They just need to do one thing. They need to lie on the ground straight. Okay. And palms facing upwards to receive. Just close their eyes. So do they need to lie on the ground or can it be on a bed also? Bed also. Okay. Anywhere. Some, but but they can't sit. Out. Those who want healing cannot sit. Okay. Then they will not be healed. You can't walk. You cannot sit. If you don't have a space, then automatically healing will not reach to you. Okay. And they shouldn't be checking their phones. <laughs> if, you check, <laughs> see, if you want to check your phones, then don't come for this healing only. Na, because that again shows there is so much of anxiety in your mind. Okay. What do you want to check your phone for? Okay, so I'll just uh, wear my robe and come back. Yeah, so we'll give everyone a couple of uh, a little bit of time to just like find a place that where you can lie down. You have to lie flat with your palms facing upwards. Yeah, just flat on your back with your palms facing upwards and try to just keep your phone on. You can keep your headphones on. Um, so that you can follow Dr. Gitanjali as she talks us through it. Or you can put your phones on uh, speaker mode if it doesn't bother anyone else around. Just give everyone a minute uh, to do this. I, I see a lot of people have put in a bunch of questions around their problem. Uh, and I hope some of it we've addressed already. Some of it are, are uh, our shared problems like money blockages and family issues. Anything else that we, in, in case we don't get to address it on the call, Doc is going to be around and she will be um, answering your questions on the group. Yeah, even after the call. Um, Karuna, if you have the sticks, yes, of course, go ahead and keep it. So everyone, this is a, going to be a group exercise, Pallavi. So of course, you're going to get the healing as well. Uh, so will you, Rupali, everyone in the group right now, all you need to do is just lie down flat on your bed or, or on a mat on the ground, whatever is comfortable for you. Keep your palms facing up. <laughs> Happy Guru Purnima. So how many people are there? 265. So I'm going to make a... And uh, Doc, uh, some of them, like I think Karuna mentioned that she has the sticks as well. She's done Lama Fera before, so she can put it... Definitely, definitely. Gina's also shared that uh, she has used Lama Fera symbols during COVID especially with her breathing problem. Yeah. And it did a miracle at the time. Uh, in fact, she says my mom also was not affected by COVID because uh, she, she used Lama Fera during that time. How wonderful. Gina, you, you can definitely revise uh, the course if you want. Um, Doc has some beautiful offers today, so we'll share that after the exercise. Um, and you can see whether you'd like to do the course again to just re revise everything. All right, I'm going to mute myself, Doc. Yeah, please.
please keep your child away, Chaitanya. What's tell you? It's it's not safe for him. All of you, close your eyes. I'll be doing the fera. I want all of you to touch your third eye and say disconnect uh, and say disconnect, disconnect, disconnect. Touch your right toe and say th th disconnect, disconnect, disconnect. Touch your left toe of your feet and say disconnect, disconnect, disconnect.
Well, you can open your eyes. I kept it small because I don't know. Thank you so much, Doc.